Hey everyone, Ace is here to dive into the topic of world settings in Grappolis. Today, I'm going to be talking about the different world settings that you may encounter during your time in Grappolis and how they affect your gameplay. Before we begin, please make sure to subscribe to this channel and look out for more of our content as we go through the basics of Grappolis. If you don't have many worlds under your belt, then you probably haven't experienced all the different world settings for yourself. These settings will determine the speed of the world as well as how you try to achieve victory. Each world will also have its own unique settings for night bonus and beginner's protection, and you may occasionally find a world that has you start with multiple cities. So what should you look for when checking out a new world's settings? Typically, the most distinguishing factors of a world are the conquer system and the endgame. Currently, there are two conquer systems, Revolt and Conquest, whereas the end game of a world is how one alliance will achieve victory. These can range from domination to world wonders to temples. I'd recommend you give each one a chance and decide for yourself which one you may prefer. Outside of those settings, you definitely want to check out the game speed. These speed settings will determine how fast buildings are upgraded, units are created, as well as how fast units travel and trade happens. Speed 1 through 4 are going to be your normal Grepolis settings, getting faster as the number goes higher. These speed settings will go up all the way to 6, which is what would be referred to as a fast world. These settings give you the opportunity to decide how fast paced you want your experience to be. Typically, a faster world will require you to be a bit more active with your approach, and the lower numbers, such as a speed 1 world, will allow you to be more casual. Lastly, I would recommend checking the Night Bonus option on a world's settings. Night Bonus will give a defensive buff during a certain period of time, attempting to allow the user to get some rest without the worry of getting conquered in the night. As you can tell, there are plenty of different options when a new world is announced that can all provide varying experiences to you during your time in the world of Grepolis. I'm sure as you play you will begin to develop your favorites and anticipate the next world release. If you want to stay updated on future worlds and their release dates, make sure to check out the Grepolis forums online. Good luck out there and have fun spending your time in Grepolis.